Speaking of Tibetan beverages, you may think of the Highland barley wine, sweet tea, and yak butter tea. But have you tried a cup of freshly brewed coffee? Here in downtown Lhasa, I'm surprised to see coffee shops almost in every block. Some of them blend in perfectly with the Tibetan style old buildings. Only the aroma gives it away. So I just ordered a cup of Lhasa latte and it comes with a beautiful silverware. Let me take a sip of it. It actually has a fragrance of the greens. So what's special about this Lhasa latte? Uh, this is our most popular latte with some highland barley and some yak Tibetan cheese and butter. Coffee is not new in Tibet. The beverage was first introduced into the plateau region in the early 20th century. Now it's easy for you to indulge in a cup of coffee in Lhasa and often in the Tibetan style. 整个是呈现在一个藏式的碗里面，就受到了很多游客还有嗯我们本地的老客人的喜爱。我们的想法就是想把外面在流行的一些东西带进来，然后在在本地融合藏式的元素。我们店里面的咖啡豆其实基本上
From my tour today, I found that in Lhasa, coffee is not just a beverage that stimulates people's taste buds. It also stimulates the fusion between the modern and the traditional, the local and the global.